Hi, welcome to Ask Ideans Test Series Introduction Video. This video shows how easy it is to take tests with Ask Ideans. So let's begin. You need to enter into your account and from the classroom sources, you can see the test which you have given till date. As you can see here, the test you have given till date. Any test with status active tells you that the test can be taken now. Generally, a test is active for some limited period of time. This period of time can be seen in start and due date. To take the test, click on take test. The window appears with the name of the test, the number of questions and the time allocated for the test. You can start the test when it is 100% loaded. As you can see here, it is showing it is 100% loaded. We can start the test. The time to complete your test is 2 hours. Here you can see the duration. If you have any problem in viewing the questions due to the font size, you can change the font size of the questions as per your requirement from the bottom of the page. As you can see, I am changing the font size of the question paper. When you start the test on the right hand side top corner you can see the timer which shows how much time have been used and how much is left along with how many questions you have covered so far. The back and next tab gives you freedom to move through all questions throughout the test. On left hand top corner just below the logo of Ask ITNs you can move to any particular question at any time. While attempting the questions, you can either bookmark or flag any particular question. The flagged question can be later viewed separately. If you have answered any question which you do not want to attempt later because of some confusion, you can click on reset to deselect the answer. Let's see how it is. At the bottom of the test page, you get options to view questions in group. That is, you can see all attempted, unattempted and flagged questions, which can help to minimize time taken in revision. There is also an option to report error for the question which you think the answer are not correct or the question is not correct. To end the test, click on finish test. It pop a window on top of the test page showing how many questions you have completed and how many are still incomplete. As soon you finish the test, your performance analysis get generated, which has been explained in the other video. So hope this video helps you in giving the test. Thank you very much.